Hey everyone, it's Tom from Elite Experience. Uh, it's Monday night, 6.38 p.m. Yeah, uh, just uh, doing some reading, some research for some clients, and just generally, uh, actually probably just going to go in and do my back assistance work because I feel like training again. So yeah, I uh, just got a question from Daniel, and uh, I got to be honest, I love these questions. Like, you know, we at Elite Experience, like we've developed a lot of systems on how to train, and uh, you know, people will come along and they'll be like, "Hey, I was on the internet and I found this workout. What do you think of it?" And I'm like, "Well, what the?" What do you think I think of it? Like it's, I'm, it's, why don't you just do the one we showed you how to do? Like it worked, remember? Yeah. So, you know, it's this shiny new thing that just, it kind of, it comes back to a post I put up uh, earlier, which was about levels of training. And it's like, you know, before you go looking for like, if you're on a fitness program and it was working for you and you stop it because something happens in your life or you're lazy or you had to stop because you like whatever, when you decide to start again, don't go looking for a new workout. Dust off the one that was working perfectly well for you before. Um, if you type in workout programs on Google, here, let's just see what happens. Yeah, this will be interesting. I'm going to go with like 5 million, but maybe not. I don't know. Workout programs. Let's even say for men to build muscle. 10,400,000 results. So do I want to go through every single one of those and critique them? Not at all. Not even remotely. But you know what, Dan? You're a good guy. So I'm going to go through this one for you. Oh, great. Well, it's crap. Um, for one, it's a body part split. Um, you don't need a body part split. You need to learn how to use your body functionally because you're in the military and you need to know how to be strong. This is a bodybuilder program. Um, you know, it's this is like, and I'm looking at this thing, it's... Uh, I'm not going to say which one. I don't want to get, you know, somebody being upset at me for crapping all over the program. But the way this is presented is great because it gets you all pumped up and it looks super, you know, well thought out. Honestly, a program that has been designed but has absolutely no, uh, like, has not been programmed for you at all is completely useless. Okay. What is really valuable is actually knowing how to do a squat, a push-up, a lunge, a deadlift. And then when you're watching those exercises happen, you're going to see things that people do. And depending on what you see, you're going to program other exercises or you're going to cue things differently. Okay? So off-the-shelf workout programs, uh, you know, with a few exceptions, like maybe like, I don't know, Wendler's 531 or Juggernaut or a few that have been designed by like guys that have attempted to put some sort of periodization in for you uh, in that you count the reps and you make changes based on that. And, you know, I mean, Wendler's program asks you to kind of figure out what kind of assistance work you need to do and it gives you a lot of choices. So it's more of a like a template than it is a program. And that's why it's good. Uh, but these types of programs, I think they're shit. There you go. You want to know? Um, and uh, just, you know, that's pretty much what it comes down to. All right. Well, hope that was the answer you were looking for. If you're hoping for, it's the best program I've ever seen. Holy crap. I'm going to go out and start it right now. What I've just wasted the last 11 years of my life. I don't like forget what I know. I'm just going to go do this. Well, maybe next time.